Hey guys, I've got a little off track on this truck. It's, it's missing on number five cylinder. So I've not made up my mind if I'm gonna go ahead, pull the motor and just rebuild it as quickly as possible. Or if I'm going to just pull the heads and uh, figure out what's going on. I believe it's got a burn valve. Um, anyway, I, again, I've got sidetracked on this thing. <coughs> I've been fooling with everything else around here. So, um, rod run is here in a couple weeks. So, I'm going to see what I can do with this old truck. I don't know how well it's going to go. But, this is probably a thousand to $1,500 truck. The way it sets, and that's when somebody's wanting it. Uh, just because, like I said, it's ugly. But, I'm going here now. I'm going to go get a set of wheels and tires. Probably do the 20-inch gray torque thrust like I did on the other one. I'm going to try to strip some more of this paint off. And I may go ahead and order the chrome to go back on the side. It's not terribly expensive. So, I may go ahead and order that. I'm going to get a bumper. Uh, again, I'm going to do the 4.6 uh, drop like on Primer's Best Truck Sky. I like the 5.7, but I think it's just a little too much. The last one I had, it was a lot of trouble. It bottomed out and uh, kind of aggravated me. I, I spent a lot of money on shocks and stuff trying to get it straightened out, and I finally did. But anyway, uh, do the 4.6 drop, put the wheels and tires on it, uh, put the sport bumper on it, maybe this chrome on the side, and figure out what's going on with the motor. I've got a horrible transmission leak. <coughs> Probably the dipstick. I don't know for sure. I'm going to have to crawl in there and figure that out. But again, I don't know if I'm going to just try to fix that or just pull motor transmission. I'll rebuild it and put it back in. I've got two weeks to do it in. Uh, so we'll see how it goes. The interior is rough on this truck, but it's super solid. The truck's solid. I went ahead and put new window motors in it. Got the windows and stuff working good. So I know the brakes are good. I had went through those before I parked it, so I'm going to see. It's I'm probably going to put somewhere between two to three thousand more dollars in the truck, and some time and labor, and we'll see what it brings at the rod run. If it even sells, if it don't, that's fine. Again, not a big deal, but I'm just going to see how it goes. But uh, anyway, stay tuned, and I will update y'all as I get things done. It's going to be some long days and nights. I don't know if I'm going to get it done. Uh, it's just me by myself, so. We'll see. Like I said, I got two weeks, but I've also got a yard to mow. I've got a, a newborn baby, so we'll see how all this goes. Anyway, y'all have a good one, and I'll update you as I get some things done. Have a good one.